Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Steam World Quest. Last we left off, I was standing in front of this painting, if I remember correctly, and we were about to walk into this room, which will inevitably lead to a boss. Or bridge, not a room. Give faith to what is unseen as you would to what one can touch and look at. And look at. Gotta learn how to talk again. Okay, that was actually pretty cool. After having used the yucky old eye from the tower, our heroes raced over the bridge. Alright, over the bridge we go. Where, will it, where we will end, nobody knows. I should really stop doing, like, your tongue twistery. Wow, 67. I'm really bad at these. I'm usually pretty good about clearing out chests in games, but apparently not this one. Having bridged the chasm, our persistent pupils enter the main building of the college. Chapter 9. Back to school. Sounds pretty nice, actually. College was fun. I enjoyed college. Oh yeah, these two weirdos. Wow. After doing my best to leave the shackles of this place behind me, I burglarize my way back in. Oh, Copernica. I'm just happy you're not like these snooty brats. It's okay. Right. Back to school. Let's do this. Alrighty. Let's continue. Our path to school. Hopefully we can get a bachelor's degree and not go into debt. What are you? You look like something I can interact with. Or not. Loose lips of Alokui. Attention all students, by degree of your headmistress. Burner discipline is removed from the course list and replaced by body, soul, and gold. Huh? What kind of lesson is... Th this... It sounds almost like... Like... That voice struck a chord with you? I... I'm not sure. Anyway, let's move on. Confounding. I see. So she may know this person, so it may be someone she, uh, possibly went to school with. Hello. Die. Do me a solid and go ahead and die for me. Uh, re-roll that. Re-roll that. And we can't re-roll anymore. Okay. Oh, sounds like the garbage is being emptied. Sorry if you can hear that. Let's see, so they're weak to lightning, 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 oh yeah, it's it's making some noise out there. I've explained uh, what it actually is, but it's like a big machine that comes and just picks up the garbage can. So they're very weak to lightning, so let's go with that. I guess I'm starting with that enemy since that's the one I poisoned. Stay down! And get a good old Electrolyze, and now we're gonna get our defense lowered. I've never picked up on that, um... Uh, Armelie actually puts her, uh, face mask down in the fight. I'm not sure exactly if that's what you'd call that on the helmet. I guess it is? Really have no idea, though. I think their attacks are physical, so that might be good. Blizzard is not much use against them. Yeah, they're very, very resistant to ice. Let's just go ahead and re-roll those. Ooh. That. And yeah, Guillotine Fist. Hopefully it uh, instantly kills the enemy. Or scraps them, sorry. We're about no violence here. Nope. Unfortunately, did not murder it. Oh well, I tried. I used a bunch of my steam too, but... Oh well, gonna roll with the punches. Reroll Blizzard. I don't think I want Intercept either, or that. Jeez, yeah, this is uh, 
bad deck for me to be rolling against this particular enemy type. Yeah, you know what? Let's just use three Armily abilities so we can get bleed down on this enemy. Seems like the best way to go. Just do as much damage as possible. And stack as many effects as possible. How dare you slime sword me. That is rude. And there they go, coming on me. I don't appreciate that. Uh, so we can put the poison on someone else, electrolyze you, and probably cast regen on ourselves, because we're probably going to be taking a fair amount of damage. I also should have uh, switched Copernica's accessory if uh, I was going to have no fire attacks in our uh, deck. So, yeah, I might want to switch that after the battle. At least until I decide to put them back in. And I still have Fiery Bash in. Okay, so... That should be able to kill that enemy. You know what, why don't we just ass make sure that enemy dies. And... Then we can lacerate a different enemy. There we go. And their heal is uh, pretty annoying too, because it's a fairly large heal. Like, that heals a good amount of health. <clears throat> Let's guillotine fist you. And then get rid of the mana barriers. Ooh, another electrolyze. Yeah. So maybe the guillotine fist will kill this enemy outright? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I like that ability. That's a good ability. And just just the chance to um, just completely take an enemy out of the fight that's full health is way too good to pass up. But yeah, that is a good one. Uh, we definitely don't need that. Well, how about we just go for three armly attacks? The last raid isn't going to do much extra damage, but it'll refresh the bleed effect, I guess. So, that's something. Not the best move I could have made, but I think they... Yeah, no, they're going to die. Goodbye. Now we get to collect our treasure. Level 20. Huh. I honestly expected that to be max level. Usually it is in these kinds of games. Pernica got some more HP, Galio got some more HP, and Armily got more damage. Fantastic. Open the old chest. Thunderstorm. Deals 90% magic as storm damage to a random foe four times. That's the most powerful lightning spell we've gotten so far, but I feel like it's kind of wasted because I don't have Auric in the party. Because that would make it hit another time, so... Maybe I'm just crazy, though. Feels like a waste. Um, yeah. Getting Fixer in as early in the battle as possible is never a bad idea. What are you weak to? Ice. Finally. Whoops. Pressed the wrong button to try to re-roll that. Um. Yeah. Let's, let's just go ahead and go with a simple term like that. <clears throat> simple term? Turn. I can do words. So yeah, now we have four steam. Maybe guillotine uh, fist will come up and we can just murder one of these outright with all of our steam power. That would be nice. Ideal, even. Intercept. Eh. Regen. No. Shields up. Definitely not. So, I guess let's just mana barrier. Uh, there we go. Oh, cool, we got a paralysis there. Unfortunately, this one didn't get par uh, paralyzed. Okay, now we finally have some uh, magic to go around. 
That's honestly not super great, because Creeping Cold almost does nearly as much damage, but hey, it's a lot of that uh, particular type of damage, so might as well go ahead and get it in. Because they are weak to ice, so this should hurt them a bunch. Possibly even kill that one. Achievement unlocked Achilles heal. It must be for targeting a certain amount of enemies' weaknesses. That's neat. It's about to pop. Oh, and it has increased magic. So that's really going to hurt if it goes off. Okay, let's see what all we can get. That. That. And I guess Fiery Bash, just in the hopes that that will finish it off. It should. Oh yeah, no, it's dead. It's super, super dead. Goodbye. Fiery Bash. Alrighty. Another enemy falls to our blade and magic. Let's not forget to destroy the books before we leave. Nope, no money for us. Curse those people for not hiding money in their books. Hey, there's something written on the chalkboard. It says important. Maybe it's a clue or something that can help us. Fellow alchemists and corget enthusiasts. Oh no, should I be writing this down? Potentially. Let me get my little scrap of paper I've written various notes on for different games. Uh, is that the hint, though? Let's see. My research on the rumored mega zucchini referred to by mountain tribes as the golden marrow or sasquash. Maybe I'll write down golden marrow and sasquash. I feel like it might be a password of some sort. Golden marrow. Sa squash. Feels like it might be important. It has finally come to fruition. Supposedly the golden marrow has migrated to the Dark Frost Mountains. From a strange territory rich with unknown flora and fauna. For future map revisions, I have decided to call this strange territory the Cursed Land. That Killjoy Council Patrick doesn't like it, so everybody should really start calling it until it sticks. I am putting together a mountain expedition. Anyone interested in joining in and becoming part of Zucchini history can sign their names here. Yours sincerely, Professor Lemiel. P.S. Don't forget to pack your marble pillows. How many signed up for this cuckoo trip? Let's see. None. No. Who doesn't want to go on an expedition to a crazy area? Oh, it's the Shutter Shade variety. And I didn't get the uh, preemptive attack in. What are you weak to? Ah, you're weak to fire and you're weak to ice. So now we run into a bit of an issue. Oh yeah, and I forgot to check. Damn it. You know what, I should just put my fire spells back on. Because with Fiery Bash, even if enemies are very resistant to uh, fire, I can still do pretty good damage to them. Which one was the one... Oh, neither of you care about lightning. Okay. I think you're the one that's weak to ice. Yeah. Just wanted to verify. Cool. And just a regular attack, I suppose. That'll fill out my first turn. Eat lightning and cold. And a sword, apparently. So, raises. Ooh. That's a pretty big buff to magic. And they'll dodge? Oh no. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Fiery Bash. And heroic strike. And missed. But that one hit. Can't dodge them all. Ow. Ooh. Ow, that is actually really big damage on her. Jeez. Okay, we're gonna wanna go ahead and mend you. 
and probably just do a, another heroic strike. Yeah, geez, that was really big damage on Copernica. Hopefully she doesn't die. If they keep targeting her, she might. Okay. Let's see here. Tack, tack, tack. Go ahead and finish up this fight really quickly. Oh no, mana barrier. Reroll, reroll. So this enemy's strong against Blizzard, but I think we're just gonna have to deal with it. And I can just go ahead and reapply some poison, I suppose. Alright. One more hit and this enemy should go down. Yeah, barrier. Sure. Alright, there you go. Just go ahead and die for me, thanks. Okay. Okay, so I had a little something come up, so uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode off here, actually. Just walk back out and back in just to make sure the game saves. I hope you have enjoyed, and I will see you next time.